Hey everyone, this is Charles Snyder, and I am the Marketing Ninja. I'm not going to do it today. <laughs> what I want to talk to you about is I've gotten a question that just kind of struck me differently today. And when I was writing the email, I decided that I would include it in this video uh, for today's installment. So the question basically was, what's the big deal about blogs anyway? Well, this is what the big deal is. And I'm, I'm just going to quote some uh, statistics here from uh, some a marketing uh, source that has done a number of business studies specifically dealing with inbound marketing, business blogging, etc. So I'm just going to read a couple stats off to you real quick. And some of that inv valuable information, number one, is not quite 40% of U.S. businesses use some form of a blog or blogging uh, for marketing purposes. That's just in the United States. That's not the rest of the world. The United States is uh, probably a little bit ahead of the curve in that regard. And even in some countries, it's a lot ahead of, a cur of the curve. Uh, for example, I know in the Philippines that websites are pretty static and they're not updated very often. That's just in my experience that I've seen. And... But anyway, 40, not even 40% of the U.S.-based businesses here in the United States use blogging for marketing purposes. That's a huge opportunity. That's a lot of competition that's just not leveraging the tool. Are you one of them? Hmm. <laughs> You're missing out on business. Um, but anyway, let... And this is, and this all ties in with it. So the next point is, businesses that blog, on average, this is average, draw 55% more website traffic than businesses that do not blog. That adds up. I mean, you know, you're talking, if you're talking a thousand. Well, we'll keep the number simple. If you have 100 website visitors in a month and you start blogging, the averages say that you're going to get an additional 55 people to visit the site a month. So instead of 100, you're going to have 155. If you have 1,000, that's an extra 550 people. 10,000, that's an extra 5,500 and yeah, 5,500, uh, my math's way off today. Um, <laughs> but you see, as you drive more traffic to your website, the law of averages are saying that you're gonna drive a tremendous amount more traffic to your website just by blogging. But anyway, real quick, business to customer websites, B2C, websites that blog get 88% more leads per month than businesses that don't. 88%. That's an eight followed by another eight. So again, going with, uh, say you have 100 leads a month, you start blogging, uh, creating the content that your customers want. The law of averages say you'll get another 88 people. That's, that's huge, huge. Business to business or B2B business models average 67% more leads than businesses that don't blog. And here's the whopper. Here's a huge whopper that is uh, so many businesses need to pay attention to this that just simply do not. They make a lot of excuses, but 71% of customers surveyed say that blogs influenced their buying decision. 71% of customers surveyed stated that blogs influenced their purchasing decisions. 
you have a blog. Better get one if you ain't got it. If you have one, you better start fucking using it. Or you're missing out on business. Keeping it honest, keeping it real. I'm Charles Snyder, and I am the Marketing Ninja. <laughs>